Hello and welcome to everyone. So in this video, we're going to talk about acute abdomen x-ray series. The term acute abdomen defines as a sudden and severe abdominal pain, which requires immediate medical or surgical treatment. A prompt and accurate diagnosis is very essential to minimize morbidity and mortality of acute abdomen cases. The different diagnostic includes an enormous spectrum However, imaging is routinely employed as a primary investigation tool. In this case, CT scan and ultrasound are both very accurate diagnostic ways. However, some physicians still rely on plain abdominal x-ray as they are simple, cheap, and fast. Moreover, with lower radiation dose rather than CT scan. Okay, so let's talk about some specific indications for ordering acute abdomen series. The first one is ileus, is the term for lack of movement in intestine, which can lead to obstruction, means no food or gas can get through. So finding on x-ray include air fluid levels, elevation of diaphragm with um, some dilation of intestines, as you can see here in this image. So this x-ray was performed in supine position and also an upright may help us to see the air fluid level if exists. The second indication is ascites, which is defined as an uh, abnormal amount of interperitoneal fluid. The best imaging modality to show ascites is CT scan, which you can clearly see here in this coronal section. However, a large volume of ascites can present in plain x-ray as a poor definition of soft tissues, as you can note here in this x-ray, or uh, overall increased density of the image and also uh, increased separation of a small bowl, which is also noted here and here. Okay, and the third indication is perforation, uh, which is characterized by loss of uh, gastrointestinal wall integrity. So subsequently, a leakage of entry contents, gas fluid or any material uh, which can occur in many different settings like obstruction or ulcer or surgeries and so on. The most classic, classic sign in plain x-ray is uh, free gas under the diaphragm on erect uh, chest x-ray or abdomen x-ray. And um, other indications, including um, intra-abdominal masses and also uh, after the abdominal surgeries. Appendicitis, however, is the most common indication of acute abdomen. But um, plain x-ray is not an accurate way to diagnose appendicitis. So mostly ultrasound and uh, CT scan bit uh, contrast injection is ordering. Okay, so let's talk about acute abdomen series uh, projections, which consist of uh, three projections. However, it depends on uh, the department's routine, but typically we do uh, one chest PA upright to rule out free air under the diaphragm. Direct abdomen also visualize the free air under the diaphragm, but uh, the exposure technique we using for chest x-ray best visualize the small amount of free air if present. So as I said, the second one is upright abdomen x-ray, so we can look for free air and also air fluid levels if they present, especially in case of uh, obstructions. And at last, a supine or KUB film. So we can evaluate the width of 
bowel loops and estimate the amount of distension. Regarding the positioning and techniques, uh, we completely discussed about them on separate videos you can find in our channel. However, here to mention some important factors for supine abdomen, you need to take iliac crest as the center of the image uh, to make sure that you are including the bladder. But for upright film, as we should include the diaphragm, you need to move the central ray 5 cm above the iliac crest to make sure that the diaphragm is uh, visualized under the image so we can evaluate if uh, any free air exists under the diaphragm. The breathing instruction for the chest, the x-ray should be taken at the end of full inspiration and for the abdomen film on full expiration. It's worth mentioning that if patient cannot stand or is completely bed rest, we can do the left lateral decubitus as an alternate for the upright films. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you learning something from the video. And as I said about the positioning and techniques of uh, the projections, chest PA and the abdomen x-rays, uh, you, we completely discussed about them on separate videos you can find in our channel so don't forget to subscribe us and if you have any suggestions just leave a comment thanks again